Our spotlight story tonight is about the 20th annual Ag Appreciation Parade that made its way through downtown Moses Lake and some of the people that enjoyed it. Reporter Jeff Chu has the details. Warmer winter weather attracted a large crowd of families celebrating Friday night in downtown Moses Lake. Hundreds lined 3rd Avenue to enjoy this year's Agriculture Appreciation Parade. The event is sponsored by Moses Lake Business Association. With temperatures in the mid to high 30s, it was far warmer than last year's bone-chilling temperatures and winds that deterred many. Jasmine de Beaumont, Moses Lake Business Association Executive Director, said last year's parade entries raised more than $2,000. The money goes back into the Business Association's Downtown Business Support Projects. So support supports the beautification projects. We do like the flower pots that have a for us. De Beaumont described this year's attractions. Um, we have a lot more entertainment going on down on 3rd, which is always fun to see. We brought back our Toys for Tots with the Marine Corps here locally, which is wonderful because they can um, donate towards local charities here in Moses Lake. Um, we also have warmer weather, which is a big hit with us this year because last year was a little cold. So we're happy to have that for sure. Dutch Evans Society is back with us this year because it's nice and warmed up and they're keeping our parade, um, you know, groups and stuff, which they've done in years past. So we're happy to have it back. She said a number of entries made the event more fun to those attending. Um, we have about 35, including equestrian. Um, we did get in some people last minute, which, you know, the more the merrier with these type of events. And since it's our 20th, um, we're happy to have that many people involved. The big entries include farm vehicles decked out in their best of seasons greetings. I say we have probably at least 10 or so, non-commercial and commercial. Tractors, combines, um, a few other, you know, smaller rigs and stuff too, but um, most of the bigger stuff. I'm Jeff Chu for iFiber One News. We will be right back after this.